Well, good evening, everyone. Hope you all had a good weekend. It's time for the weekend recap. We are recrapping the uh, the Maddie shit. Now, this was in the morning, Sunday morning. I don't know. It was around uh, close to noon. I don't know. I, I was up early, and she's the one yawning here. I can't hear what she's saying as I'm recording this. I'm doing a voiceover. Uh, but basically, it's a lot of yawning. She's in somebody's car. The comments were left up on this video, and people were saying it was Boulevard of Broken Oatmeal Cream Pies car. That's what I call her. I've always called her that. Um... And there was a big debate in the comments. I don't know if they're still up. Uh, the comments, the after comments on the video. I did not catch this live. Regardless, she's in somebody's car, rubbing her filthy nails all over her face, yawning. I'm probably be talking over what she's saying, but she's not saying much. She needs coffee, she needs cigarettes. She wants everybody to provide that for her. Uh, apparently she's driving this vehicle. Which is today? against the law if you don't have a valid driver's license. And yeah, so she just keeps droning on, mumbling about... Cop uh, she just picks something off her coat. Like, that's going to make her a difference in her appearance. Oh, okay. Oh, good okay. lord. Anyways, um... I threw this together. Yeah, you see me fast-forwarding here. I threw this whole video together... Uh, the morning video and the evening video is is way more exciting. But the fact that she's just driving around in somebody's vehicle... Yeah. Yeah. I would fast forward this right now, but it's in an editing program and I don't want to fuck up the whole thing. Yawn, yawn, yawn. I, I don't, why is she so tired? Does she take care of a household? Does she work? Uh, help, help, uh. Hard day at the office? Uh, what's going on here? Your life's not that hard. You don't have to do anything. All you do is get high. And get everything handed to you. So shut the fuck up with your pity story. <laughs> what's it positive, Bailey? She's looking like one of the uh, Angelina Jolie's kids, the one that thinks it's a boy that keeps cutting its hair off. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I, I can't go into all that right now. I'm tired. I'm trying to recap all this. Two videos today. The morning one was about 30 minutes. The evening one was like an hour. I condensed that one down to about 20 minutes. But that one's way funnier. So I think she's, uh, <clears throat> uh, excuse me, it's kind of late. I should be sleeping right now. Uh, where the hell is she going? Looks like she's by a Dollar Tree or something. I am. That bowl cut. The evening chat, uh, I didn't capture all of it. Uh, but people in the live chat were asking her if she sold her hair. She just, she don't answer nobody. But you know what? She did sell her hair because if you watch Tom's read, uh, I'm sorry, Tom Reed's videos from a long time ago, he had interviewed Ginger. She had really, really pretty red, natural red hair. And uh, a year or two goes by, he interviews her again, and her hair was super short. And she said, "There's a guy in Southwest and over on Michigan Avenue as well. He's some kind of weirdo that buys the girls' hair." And she had sold her hair. That's where that started. That's not a rumor. That is fact. Right out of one of them girls' mouths. So, 
Alright, what is she? Oh, this is the evening one. Okay, I'm not paying attention to my own video. She appears to be uh, munching on some candy. Walking around. She's mumbling. She, she's... I don't think she's dope sick in this one. I think she's really kind of high in this one. Yeah, people are giving her suggestions for rehab and stuff. I didn't uh, capture the chat in this. It's all the same damn simps. Uh, there's a, like a handful of simps. If you don't know what simps are, you know, just Google that. I don't have... I can't explain it. You know, the ass kissers. Here I am fast forwarding. Uh, she's talking and talking. He gets mad at, at other, other people piss him off. It's funny because when yeah, she gets into the it, store, the oh, she gets into the CBS over here. She's she's picking up stuff and you can tell she's putting it in her, in her coat. And people are asking her, where's Gerald, this and that. She never answers. He's right behind her. He He's always right behind her. And then when she gets into the store, he is right behind her. What? Like, he's the lookout as she's... You can hear her shoving things in her coat. Now, mind you, I think that CVS closes at 9. She went in there at 8.45 p.m. There's hardly any staff. There's no customers. They do that on purpose because they think they can get away with it. Like, no one's going to be watching them. She's not at the store yet. She's at, on the side of the EL Mercado uh, oh, charging yeah. her phone. That is not the taco truck. That That's EL Mac or, or EL or E and J Mercado like store, store. They're not allowed in there anymore. They haven't been for a long time. The taco truck is a few feet away and it is owned by that Mercado. What? So she's not what actually plugged in to the taco truck. She's into the uh, side of the store where there's an outlet. There's a little bit of confusion over there about that. Okay. Uh, she's mumbling on. Look at look at how high she is. They know you, bro. People are telling her, "You look great, Maddie. You're beautiful." What are we in? Only seven minutes in. I can't tell. I have this in an editing program as I'm doing the voiceover. Uh, there's still people in the chat that try to give her um, mm -hmm. resources, advice, and she just bypasses mm -hmm. it. She doesn't care. She knows what to do. She's been out there long enough. She knows where all the resources are. She is so fucked up right now. And her thumb is, jeez. At one point, I don't know what point I'm at in the video, but she talks about her thumb because people are asking. She's like, I'm going to go get more antibiotics. Me, 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 me. Of course. Yeah, I don't know how you're going to do that if your Medicaid's canceled. You're trying to cancel your Medicaid. Well, that one dumbass broad from Ohio is trying to cancel your Medicaid so you can get a grant. A grant? A grant to go to Ohio rehab? You don't live in Ohio. How are you going to get an Ohio grant when you live in Michigan? What the fuck is all that about? That lady that's trying to help her, I'm going to be politically incorrect right now when I say this, but I don't really give a shit. That lady is retarded. There, I said it. I said what I said. Well, they know I'm an addict. She can't even take care of her own family. She's worried about this damn ass junkies up here in Detroit. Lady, take care of your own damn business. It just depends. Right. Stop acting retarded depends about this. Depends on what you're going there for, but most of the time. For your husband's gonna leave your ass pretty they soon. They usually know about what you go there for. He'll drop you off at that bando. Say see ya. She'd probably like that though. Oh, here we go. She's in the store. She is so messed up. So messed up. Uh, this is so strange because... <laughs> right? Oh, jeez. Okay, first of all, there's nobody in there. Oh, she's looking at nails. Fake nails. And she keeps picking them up. What about you? These are fit like that fingers. 
Oops. Yeah, I fast forwarded through some of this and then I went back and yeah, I went backwards. Yeah, I didn't edit this very well. I went backwards and then I went forwards again. Um no, it's not really because I just couldn't believe it. She's in there looking at all these fake fingernails. Uh, I guess I'm gonna go in here. I don't know if I kick when she out. what are you gonna do? You, instead of washing your hands and scrubbing your real nails, you're just gonna throw fake ones on there? I think what she's doing is trying to shoplift high dollar items that are not behind glass. A lot of a lot of things in these drugstores in the ghetto, they're behind glass, like shaving cream and razors and laundry detergent. It's all behind locked glass. So some of the nail products are kind of pricey, like some of the nail polish brands could be eight to ten to twelve or fifteen dollars a piece. And that's what she's trying to do right here. She's trying to pocket stuff. You hear wrappers crinkling and then you don't hear them crinkling anymore. She's shoving things into her coat. Um, maybe she knows there's a demand somewhere for some fake nails or something. She, she knows there's a street value for it. So she's going right to that. I'm speculating no, on Ryan, that. I don't. But I mean, why else would she be I'm over there? Not. She's not interested in doing her fucking nails. She don't even wash her hands or nails that she has. That's why her damn thumb's infected. I don't know what that is she's holding up. But she was shoving stuff in her coat. You can hear the wrappers crinkling and then they stop crinkling. Now she's going to keep showing all these nails. And then you'll see Gerald in the background. Like he's a lookout. You can see him looking around. Mind you, this store wants to close in about 10 minutes. And they think no one's watching them. Oh, but there is. Oh, she wants that too. Oh, I want this. I want that. It's around. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm trying not to purp really loud. Um, nice hair, Maddie. You need to go over to the shampoo aisle. Why are you looking at fake nails? Get get out, get your ass over to the shampoo aisle. Go over to the condom aisle as well. Here too. They probably got them locked up too. And she's just, just talking gibberish right now. Gibberish, gibberish. She's telling Gerald. Well, he already knows his role. He's in the back over there. He's like looking. He's got his head on a swivel. Looking for that security guard. They know where the cameras are pointing. Yeah, those are hideous, Maddie. She looks like the Joker right now. Look at the bags under her eyes. I'm not trying to trash the way she looks or nothing, but come on. She is so lost in space. Looking at all these fake fingernails. Look at her. Oh my god. I want to fast forward to this, but like I said, I have it in an editing program and I'll mess up the whole thing. You guys like my intro with the little newspaper flash there? I get a copyright strike on that because I use that song, but I don't care. I like it. Then you know, like before she gets busted, you'll hear it when when it gets to that. I'll shut up so you can hear what's going on. But when she's about out the door. Uh, she's looking at Oreo cookies and stuff, and it's so funny. She keeps touching them, which is disgusting. Because people shop there. Nobody wants... Uh, this is why you need to have your hand sanitizer, people. I know the, they say the pandemic is over or whatever. It's not. And even if it is, bitches like her, all nasty, that never bathe for months, all in there, wiping their snot on everything, touching all these products... Please, please use your hand sanitizer and wash your hands thoroughly after touching things in the store. See that? Look at that. Now someone else is going to touch that and who knows what they're going to get. It's unsanitary. And it don't even have to be that way. See them nail products called Essie? Them are like, she's looking at that nail polish. That Essie brand's like nine bucks a bottle. She probably got a pocket full of it. And it's funny because all these bitches in the chat are talking. Oh, hee hee ha ha, those would look good on you. Oh, those are cute. Right, those are cute. 
totally ignoring the fact that no. she's in outer space right now and she's stealing. She's boosting. Yeah, Gina basically <laughs> chopped it off so it can grow out. She ain't whining healthy. about coffee and cigarettes now, is she? I know how they're so long. She's it's about to leaving. fill her coat. I know, I Look, I all that shit's probably going. Look at Gerald. He's like, he's looking at the prices. He's probably telling her, get that one. Like, no, yeah, see him look to the side? Though. Look, he's the backup. Uh, Everyone in the chat's like, hi, Gerald. Oh, look, her baby. His baby is shopping. His baby shopping for beauty products. How cute. He just loves her. Exactly. And you'll see near the end here when the True, security guard you. or manager, she don't show who it is. <laughs> Gerald's punk ass don't say a thing. No rule. Which I'm trying to... Oh. And she you keeps mean, running her mouth like, well, I'm not stealing. I don't have no nothing. Rule. I was going to buy something. No, no, you weren't, bitch. You weren't going to buy shit. You probably got about... 30, 40 bucks worth of shit right oh, in your shit. coat. And they didn't frisk you down because they ain't allowed to. And they ain't going to call the cops. Because if it ain't worth a certain like dollar amount, it ain't worth key. pressing charges for. But they I got her like fucking the, uh, number. Candy hearts. They know. What is this thing? Just one more store you ain't allowed to go into again. I know, I've seen those ones at the Dollar Tree. They got them. Where you can, um, She's all blah, 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 blah. Yeah, this is cute. Like, this is cute. I want this one. Stuff. I like this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Eight pre-baked cookies, icing, glittery sugar, and necessities. And from what I can recall oh, from the live crazy. chat in this, there was like two people kissing her ass. Everybody else was getting deleted for saying, you know, uh, did you call 8800 number yet for the rehab? Maybe he's a window shop. She totally <laughs> ignores that. Actually, one person said, "Do you even pay attention to your, uh, to your, yep, uh, subscribers?" Mm. She didn't answer that. And these faces she's about to make right now. Oh, I've got three new right, emails. Right, we just got so to put her I don't care about no damn emails. I want to go to bed. I want to. I gotta download this video and go to bed. Caramel coconut. Ooh. We got Whitman's and we got Russell Stover's. This one's better. These flavors. Mm. We got milk chocolate caramel, dark chocolate coconut, and milk chocolate vanilla cream. Maybe she's buying oh, these, or uh, maybe she oh, wants these fingernails for Gerald. Oh, they do have pretty, uh... Yeah, he's doing it right. Maddie, get over by the soap and shampoo. If you're gonna steal anything. Go over by the water, since you're always so thirsty. The jelly side? What are you talking about? You can't steal no cigarettes there. CVS don't sell cigarettes anymore. Or alcohol. Uh-huh. You know how much you love this? That's why I fucking stopped going there. This is my fave right here. If you don't sell cigarettes and alcohol, I have no use for you. What? <laughs> Alright, is she by the cookies yet? Once she gets over there by the... Oh, <clears throat> God, she looks so oh, evil. You see how she looks out the side of her eye? She's looking around. Because she knows her oh, coat's full of stuff. Now she's going to go over by the cookies. This is where she fucks up. She should have just walked out. She's got to stop over by this display of cookies. Right? And then that's when the, the dude gets Ain't pissed off truth. and kicks them out their stuff. Their stuff really and accuses right them of stealing. You know she's innocent and Maddie wouldn't steal. Look at that face. Ah. Okay. Oh. What is it? <laughs> Coffee crunch. Oh, they got chocolate peanut butter oh pie. My God. Oh, that was funny. Oh my God. I have to look at that again later. <laughs> that was funny. Please, please, yeah. Oh my Carrot shit. cake Oreos. Come on now. Uh, Why are you she was about to stroke out or something there. 
Oh my god. Look at Gerald behind her. Oh, there's my baby yeah, shopping. Dude. Look at my baby $50. looking at all the beauty products. Mm, you amazing. I like these ones. Uh, chocolate confetti cake. I bet you those are really good. Oh my god. Uh, damn, I want some carrot cake ones. Uh, he, he's like uh, an anyway. idiot savant. Like Rain Man or something. <sighs> Burn baby, burn baby, Charlie Babish, burn baby. A fake Tony. That's what's going through his head. That's a good idea, Gorilla Glue. I don't know. Oreos, carrot cake oh, Oreos. I'm telling you, girl, if you don't have access to water, go get you, go get you that dry shampoo. It sprays on. It'll fit right in your, in your coat. Shove that in your coat. They got Put that dry shampoo in that greasy hair to absorb it all. Cream. You don't need them cookies. <sighs> she wants some cookies too. She's all, I want these, you guys. The carrot cake ones. They, got they don't fit in your coat. Ultimate chocolate flavor cream. No. Ooh, did you see them track marks? Chocolate. Ugh. Or they got chocolate peanut butter pie. You see that shit? Oh, these... These She's like right one here. big infection on. walking Please, around there, touching everything. Oh, Stop touching oh, shit. Goodness, I want these so bad. They got lemon. I bet good you those God. are good. I want either these ones or these ones. Caramel, coconut. Oh my gosh, I bet you those are. Yeah, we've seen cookies before. Why? Why don't you get the fuck out of there? Yeah. Why you still yeah, got a chance? Good. She's gonna get busted. Who died? She thinks someone's gonna cash at her so oh. she can get some cookies. Alright, here she is getting busted. Yes, I really do. Them carrot cake ones so bad. Oh, I gotta get off here, guys. My phone's about to die. Is it oh this part? God, I'm so stressed out. I just wanna. Oh, she's all stressed out. This is where she's just, oh, I'm so stressed out. Because your life is so hard. You have so many responsibilities. Poor thing. Who died? Get your finger out of your ear. It's bad enough you put them in your eyes, in your mouth. She's got that Jim Carrey face that's made out of putty. Looking like Don Knotts from Three's Company. Mr. Furley. Ugh, oh, I shouldn't be so saying that shit, but come on. Look at her necks like Iggy Pop. Easter Reese eggs. Bye -bye. Oh, I want this. Oh, she put it nope, back. Chocolate and cereal No eggs. more room left in your oh, coat. Oh, this guy's gonna come okay. up. You guys gotta leave. That's <laughs> This is the funniest part coming up. Huh? I don't have nothing. Whatever you got. Sir, I don't have Sir, I don't have anything. I'm buying this candy. Sweetheart, all I have is this, sir. I put that on my you gonna buy and get out the store. Right. Oh, please, my man. You can't go back to the back of the store. You know what? I'm just gonna leave. I was gonna buy that. <laughs> Didn't nobody steal shit? You don't want to steal nothing. Wow, though. Oh my god. I'm so tired of people, man. This shit crazy, dog. I don't want to feed shit. If we stole something, I'm pretty sure. No one stole shit. <laughs> oh my God. Uh.
Why don't they call the police then? I don't steal. Oh, I hate people. If we stole something, why they let us sleep? Because we didn't steal shit. You walking fucking disease. Do whatever you want, but stop being a scamming bitch. Quit stealing from people. Just stop it. Knock it off. Support your fucking self somehow. I'm sorry, but this is the most moronic, idiotic fucking bitch. So, just, uh. Anyway, I hope I condensed it enough for you. And, uh, yeah, I'm out.